today I am going to explain you the topic change of order of integration one of the important topic of double integral uh, change of order of integration why required because sometimes when in double integral when we are evaluating that time uh, it's so much difficult to evaluate in that order what they give in. So, but when we can change the order of integration, then it becomes so much easy to evaluate that integral. That's why it's required sometimes. In examination point of view, they will ask you by use in change of order of integration, please evaluate. So, this is an easy topic. Uh, just you have to follow some basic steps. Uh, what is your first step? So I will take one question. Uh, change the order of of adder zero to a zero to Suppose we have this question, here some function is given dx dy, integration limit 0 to under root a square minus y square and 0 to a. Now the question is uh, change the order of integration. So first we have to think about in which order it is given. So in which order is given, see the first limit 0 to under root a square minus y square. It is given in terms of y. It means x limit given. So it means first we have to integrate with respect to x and then y. y limit is given 0 to a. Now by changing the order of integration. Here first we have to integrate with respect to x and then y. So what is the mean of change of order? It means first integrate with respect to y and then x. So how we do it? What we do? So first step, based on the given limit, draw the picture first. Based on given limit, draw the picture. So what is the limit given? y, x value, 0 x is equal to under root a square minus y square y is equal to 0 and y is equal to a this is the reason how we draw the picture x is equal to 0 means this y axis x is equal to a square minus y square. It's a circle with origin this. Then y is equal to 0 means this x axis you take minus a. Then this is a complete picture. So this is the part means a half circle only positive type side now so this is the reason half circle only positive side so now we have to change the order of integration so for that nothing is going to be changed just we have to rewrite the limits they have taken x limit first it means horizontal step so your work is now in that bounded region draw vertical line if they have taken horizontal so you draw vertical so we draw vertical line now put the limits so what is that limit what is x vertical line means y limit so what is y value at upper end y value at upper end means it lies on a circle so what is y value at upper end means 
positive a square minus x square at down it also lies on circle but negative y value below the x axis will be negative now what is uh, about uh, this is y limit then what is x limit x limit from 0 to a that's all function will be same to same here this order does not mean anything limit only matter here y limit given first it means first we have to integrate with respect to y and then x so this is the solution so again i will repeat based on given limit first draw the picture and see the bounded reason once you know about the bounded reason if they have taken horizontal strip means x limit given horizontal strip means x limit vertical strip means y limit they have given first so if they are taken horizontal you take vertical strip and rewrite the limits that's all so hope you understand this one again i am going to uh, take some more question evaluate by changing the by evaluate e to the power x we dx dy upon log y zero so how we do this question as i already told first based on given limit draw the picture so see first limit given in terms of x it means y limit given so what is y limit y is equal to e y is equal to e to the power x then x limit 0 and x limit 1 so draw the picture y is equal to e it means line parallel to x axis this is y is equal to e line y is equal to e to the power x means uh, this one because when x value 0 y value 1 so it cuts here this is 1 so this is y is equal to e to the power x curve then x value 0 means this and x value 1 means this point correct means see this is intersection so now we have to change the order so this is the boundary reason they have taken y limit first means they have taken vertical stream you can easily verify see lower end lies on exponential curve y is equal to e to the power x upper end lies on y is equal to e y value e and x value 0 to 1 so now we are going to change that order of integration how now we are going to write first because they have taken vertical strip so we are going to draw horizontal strip so put what is x value here what is x value here y is equal to e to the power x so what, what is x log y so upper end lies on log y what is x value here 0 now y limit it is start from 1 and goes up to e 1 to e dx dy upon log y now you can integrate so 1 to e first integrate with respect to x so here x term is not there so 1 upon log y constant 
one integration means x and what is the limit? 0 to log y dy. So this is log y log y cancel. So it becomes 1 to e dy. So it is e minus 1 answer. So hope you understand this is the way how we change the order of integration. I will do one more problem. Evaluate this one by change the order of integration. This is the question. So how we do? What is value given? Y limit given. So this is y is equal to x square by 4a and y is equal to 2 under root ax. Then x value 0 and x value 4a. So draw the picture. This is parabola. X square is equal to 4 a y. Means y always positive. This is x square is equal to then y square is equal to 4ax means x always positive this is 0 0 and this is 4a comma 4a and because they have taken the x y limit first it means they have taken vertical now you can see y lies at lower end what is the limit x square by 4a, y lies uh, upper vertical line and lies upper end x, y square is equal to 4ax. So what is y value? 2 under root x and x value lies between 0 to 4a. So say cut. Now we have to take horizontal. So it means x value we have to write on from this. What is x value? 2 under root ay this is upper limit what is x value at lower end y square by 4a then as usual 0 to 4a dx dy now you can calculate easily integrate with respect to y uh, x first so when you integrate with respect to x it will come to under ay minus y square by 4a dy. So integrate answer may be 16a square by 3. Please check it. Easily you can integrate because this is 2 under root a outside a root y integration you can do. So please do it. Uh, so this is the way how we go for change of or order of integration. In next uh, video, I will explain you how we convert in different types of coordinates. How we convert from Cartesian into polar, spherical, cylindrical and others. So please stay with us. Thank you.